Why are you messing? I'm not dealing with this. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So we are still in this global pandemic. And since the beginning, I was really into doing things that were completely new. One thing that really intrigued me was to garden. In June, I started my own compost bin. And now it's July 28th and it's it's amazing. I thought, oh, I can make compost. I'm gonna start my garden. I wanted to grow something that I would enjoy. So I decided to grow tomatoes along with arugula, like mix like lettuce and like a whole bunch of herbs. So I'm like so proud of my little garden. So I bought one tomato plant we're gonna get to her in a minute because something happened to her. So I started with the first one. Let's call this plant Grace. I got her from the store. It wasn't sprouting tomatoes just yet, but like it was about to. So I thought immediately, I'm gonna buy this. I'm gonna buy this tomato plant. I'm gonna have the best tomatoes ever. I was trying to live my Animal Crossing dream. I have my first tomato plant. I love her. I talk to her when I give her water. Grace is doing amazing things. Then I realized that the deers that would walk in my backyard were eating my tomatoes. Mm-mm. No, that's not gonna slide. I got really upset and then my mom was like sad to see me sad. So then she bought a big tomato plant. We'll call her Charlie. I now had two tomato plants. Why not move my tomatoes in the garage at night and then when I wake up in the morning, bring them outside. I was preventing the worst thing from happening. I thought, Wow, no deers are gonna eat my tomatoes now. I wanted to live my Animal Crossing dream. I'm tending to my plants. I'm harvesting my arugula. It was great. I felt so fulfilled. Until. So today it was really muggy and then I realized, oh shoot, I gotta bring my tomatoes back outside from the garage. Okay, you know what? This hat needs to come off. It's giving me issues. I bring the tomato plants onto the deck so i'm about to walk inside and i'm sitting outside with my mom and my mom's like sydney what's wrong with your plant why does it look like that like why does it look like it has a nose what what are you talking about sometimes they look weird when they first start to grow so then i look at it and i get to the tomato and then i like touch it and that's when i realize oh my god i'm touching the fattest caterpillar i have ever touched in my whole entire life and i don't want it on me I lose my damn mind. Oh, I touched it. I touched it. All my hard work. For what? A caterpillar eating my tomatoes? I leaped across the deck. Let everybody know at 8.30 in the morning that I just touched a huge fat caterpillar. It was probably like this long and I lost it. I, uh, apparently, I had a tomato hornworm. He ate like a good chunk of the tomato off. I'm ready to fight. So now I'm gonna try to figure out how to remove this nasty tomato worm out of my garden. You know, I tried many tactics on trying to figure out how to get rid of this guy. I tried staring at it. I tried fighting it, but you know, that can work. I just want to grow tomatoes. Like, I don't want to hurt you, but I want you to leave. So, we have to think of something. Mm -hmm, I'm scared. <laughs> Dad, do you want to come see this? Come look at it! Here, it's, fl it's a fun game. Ready? It's called Find Him. It's, uh, right there. Yup, don't touch him. See, that'll turn into a beautiful moth. No, he will. Well, no, I don't care, Dad. I don't care. My tomatoes eat most of them. You're not interfering with nature. The natural evolution of things. <laughs> Bugs look, up. Look, I took on this one. Why are you messing with <sighs> it? <laughs> it's too big. This is what I it's want. It's the size do. of my finger. <laughs> this is what I want. Mouse. Mouse. 
if or we just... you can leave it alone. Yeah, but then we have one tomato rack there. I'm not dealing with this. You'll have to listen. Come and get this damn thing. <laughs> Stand on your tippy toes, right here. What? Look at all his poop right there. See that little stuff? Oh, ew, this is freaking disgusting. Get that thing out. No, stop, don't. Get that pot, bring that pot over here, cause that pot doesn't have caterpillar cooties on it. <laughs> Pretend it's not there. I did it. You just held the camera. Well, he's gone. So now what do we have at the end of the day? I have one tomato plant that's completely fine. And I have another tomato plant that lost a branch, has one tomato left because the rest were eaten by deers and a tomato worm. Cutting the plant was the best thing to do. I could have just lifted it off, but the tomatoes were already half eaten by him anyway. So I thought, you know, might as well just chop it and leave one strong vine that has the other tomato on there. Shout out to my siblings who helped me get rid of this bug. I just wanted to grow something. I just wanted to grow some happy tomatoes. Is that too much to ask? Tomatoes on my salad, tomatoes on my sandwich. Don't want to see another one of those tomato hornworms ever again in my life. Anybody who's watching this that's a bug lover, those bugs you can have. Comment down below if you have tried gardening during this time during the pandemic. As much of a fun time I have trying to grow plants, I don't enjoy the bugs. All right guys, that is it for today's video. Comment down below what kind of videos you want me to continue to make. Also like, comment, and subscribe to this channel too. So I will see you guys in the next one. Goodbye!